Some fine oranges you have here, sir. Um, are you gonna slow down so I can get off? Sir? Sir? Thank you. Well, I... What? You're... You're good! I would... How's it going, my fellow pixel heads? Forever Echo and Arthur Morgan are back once again with more Red Dead Redemption 2. And we are here with episode 8. But one moment to talk about episode 7. What did we do? Well, me and Lenny, well, we just, oh, I'm, I, I am still just kind of... A little exhausted from all the drinking we did in that episode. But hey, what did we get from it? Gold bars. And whether those gold bars get me money. So much money. Oh, you would just not even believe. But of course, you know, that's a little bit further down the road. But today, today we're heading into Strawberry. And uh, saving Micah Bell. Yeah. Yeah, I've been drawing this out for so long, but it's it's finally time. We got we got to head into Strawberry and save that dirty, dirty man. But it is such a wonderful night. Look at that moon. It is it is just glowing. I'm really dragging this out. I just mm. All right. You know what? We're just we're just gonna cut over and just and just get this over with. Ah, I, ah, I don't want to do this. One thing I don't want to do. Yes, yes. Okay. Anywho, yeah. So, welcome to Strawberry, everyone. It is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful town. I am gonna drag this out as long as possible because Micah Bell needs to realize how much of a dirty man he is. So dirty! Why do I have to save him, Dutch? Ah, mm. oh, so I got the guns cleaned. I am I am locked and loaded and, and ready to uh, get Micah out of jail. Let's, let's, let's do this. Gonna walk in through the front door and just ask nicely. Hey, there's an asshole in here. Can I have him back? He's my asshole. <laughs> Let me deal with him. Yeah. Hello. Hello, sir. I've uh, I've come from Blackwater. I'm on the trail of a dangerous gang, Como Driscoll. Heard you had some sort of incident. We don't deal with bounty hunters around here, son. I, I was just wondering if I could get a description. Well, they weren't friends. They got in a fight, two men got killed. Now, one of them's an idiot, the other's some kind of dumb mick, so maybe them's your boys. You can look right enough when we hang them. Oh, they got my way. Oh, that storm came in quick. You think these bars can hold me? You hear me? Oh, Micah, 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 Micah. The shit you get yourself Arthur, into. Arthur! Arthur, over here! Hello, old friend. Had a good time, did you? <laughs> you going to get me out of here? I ain't decided yet. Real funny. Oh, I ain't joking, cowpoke. I heard so much bluster out of your mouth these last six months. And now, I got an opportunity to watch you be silenced. 
Well, you gotta do something. Why? I always looked up to you, Arthur. Well, that's your first mistake. Listen, there's one little problem. There's only one of me, and there's a whole town full of people wanting to see you swing. You got to do something, Arthur. This wall just needs some good forcing. Find a way to free Micah. Grab hook. Huh. Yes. Hook that over the bar. Uh. See if you can pull them off. All right, all right, all right. Hold your horses. What a modern disaster this is gonna be. Just pull that lever. Come on. All right. You better be ready for this, Micah. There'll be more law here any minute. <sighs> okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, let's go, go, go. Oh! Jesus, Micah! Already killing people! You savage bastard! Sorry. Sorry. God damn it, Micah! Get in my line of sight. I dare you, Micah. Wanna get the fuck out of here, you crazy bastard? God damn it, Micah. me like that, sir. Ah. Let's go. Where are we going? Making a house call. Only effective shot you can make. Headshot. Headshot. Every time. I need to see some. Micah, what the fuck are you doing? This is why he's dirty. They had something of mine. My guns. I showed him. And I'll Seriously? You have really lost it. This son bitch. Good. Ah. Micah, watch the left. Oh, the range! So nasty! Ow!
I want to live! Don't give up on me now! <sighs> I don't like your hat. I don't like your face. That's why I shot both. Come on, Midnight. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Micah, you. Ah! <laughs> Did Micah get what he deserved? Possibly. Well, we'll try that again, though, after a short break. <laughs> Fuck out of here. Micah, you. Ah! Okay, Michael, let's not try to get shot this time. Here, let me help you out. Crap, No shit! I'm running with Micah! Shit! Oh god, oh god. Blame you for all of this, Micah. The day is gonna come, I swear. Alright, go, 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 go. Ah. is clear. Who was that fella? Skinny? Yeah. We ran together for a while. Did a bank job down south. Didn't end well. I saw how it goddamn ended. He was gonna let me hang. I'm starting to wish I had. And you old lady Whoa. too. He hadn't found us in time. Yes, you will all be thanked profusely. I promise. Yeah, well, you're lucky Dutch has got your back. Some of See, if you get struck by lightning right now, Micah, I would not be surprised. I think we finally lost him. I hope so. I'm giving you a holster. It's my way of saying thank you. And thank you. There I was, having a dull day only for you. To liven it up by letting me help you shoot up <laughs> half a town. You're a funny fella, Arthur. Real funny. <clears throat> Why you act all sour all yeah, the time? Yeah, well, you ain't funny at all. So why you gotta act like the court chest? Right, listen. I'm sorry, but we're family now. Arthur, you and me. Sons of Dutch makes us brothers. Sometimes brothers make mistakes. Now I'm heading back to my little camp where I'm back of Strawberry. Come see me. Maybe I can make things up to you. You ain't heading back to Dutch? No, I've been a bad boy, Arthur. I ain't seeing Dutch till I can bring him a peace offering. <clears throat> Bye now. Yeah! <sighs> I 
That seriously could have gone a lot smoother, Micah. That crazy son of a bitch. Hey, stop right where you are. Time to die. Oh, shit. This That's bullshit. That's fucking bullshit. Give me my shotgun. Give me my shotgun. Get out of here! Red horse! Oh, these motherfuckers are hot. Too damn close. You ain't getting away! How many you sons of bitches left? Just you? What's that? Good plan, fellas. Yeah. You don't get to run after trying to ambush my ass. Poor move on your account, gentlemen. Very poor move. For that, your bodies will be looted. What? Who's tickling whose britches? You feeling all right there, mister? No, 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 sorry, sorry, sorry. sorry. Interested in no scrap paper? It's nothing. Just something for wiping and sniffing in the night. Yeah. Well, I got to go now. Ain't you being a little hasty here, mister? I got a hot tail. Don't you follow me now. This is as nice as I'm gonna ask. Hand it over. Now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ain't no need for that. <laughs> Oh, yes, there is. Kurt! Assault! Oh, hell. Oh, hell. Kurt, son of a bitch. Yes, son of a bitch. Get him. You! You're gonna see it! See you die! <laughs> you! Get off that horse! Um. Damn it. Hey, mister! That was nothing. He was. Shit. Take this through, you fool. Get the. <laughs> okay, got the treasure map. I'm fucking oot. I've committed enough crimes. Enough crimes. Jeez, kill a couple of people and so the whole entire town goes crazy.
get disease just wipes everyone out yeah we're not doing anything about it what I didn't do that on purpose. Don't give me that tone. Oh. Okay. Okay. Hey, 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 hey. I surrender. I sur- No, I don't. Son of a bitch. Come on now, guys. Come on. Please, stop. Son of- Ah. Mother fuck ah. Play Micah for everything Uh oh. Run him down. Son of a biscuit. No.
Come on. Gotta go. Gotta go. Yeah, damn old Triscos. much I'm worth now? You bastard. <laughs> Arthur? Miss Karen, how you getting up? Fine so far. I <laughs> to think I was once a damsel in distress, and now they got me protecting the men. <laughs> Just stay alert. Oh, I shall do. And if anyone tries anything, I'll blow their heads off. Now that's a lady. Hmm. Mr. Morgan. Yes, Miss Grimshaw. One of the girls saw that friend of yours, Mary Gillis, sniffing about. Mary? Yes. What? I never liked that woman, Mr. Morgan. Funny business. The worst of trouble out there. What? Uh, Arthur, isn't that the... Not... Come on, man. I know you don't want to talk about it. Do you just want to... All right, man. We can try to find her. But you might not like what you see. You keep your eyes open, Bill. Hello, Arthur. You been out of trouble there? Of course I am. Good. I'm done with trouble for a while. Okay, then. Mary Beth? Hey, Arthur. How's it riding? Not very good. I hear the most wonderful words in my head, and then... I ride absolute poppycock, <laughs> but I love it. <laughs> yeah, me too. <laughs> My journal. I was reading some the other day. <laughs> <laughs> I write like a fool. <laughs> <sighs> One day I'd love a beautiful fountain pen and a great desk and a quiet room and to write the most beautiful stories. Well, I can't do much about the stories or the quiet room, but 
Maybe I'll find you a pen. <laughs> Thank you. Well, now wait a minute. Did I get a pen from, uh... <coughs> Jimmy Brooks. Ah, Jimmy Brooks. I wonder what Jimmy's up to these days. Hmm. Wait. When did that note get there? Thank you, Mr. Morgan. What? For sparing me like that. I'll work hard. I am not a bad fella. You'll soon warm to me. You'll see that I do. Oh, you will. Boy, hmm. thank you for saving my life. Yeah. But yeah, of course. Dear Arthur, I've written this letter a hundred times or more, and I cannot get it right. It's me. You know it's me from the bad handwriting. I know I said when we last spoke, and I was going off to get married, that we would not speak again. I know I said a lot of things, and I meant them, I suppose, at the time. But I'm not so proud as to not speak to people who care for me, or cared for me. I've been in Valentine for a couple of months. I had some bad luck, and, well, it's a long story, and not an interesting one. But I am here for now. I saw a couple of the girls or whatever the polite term is for them, that ran with you and your associates in town. And I heard tell of a man who sounded like you. I would love to see you again, if you could spare me a little bit of your time. I'm renting a room at Chadwick Farm, just north of Valentine. Yours, Mary Linton. Mr. Morgan! Can, can I? Are you okay? Yes. Mm. That was miles away, I'm afraid. So it seems. Anyway, it's that fellow Downs. The, uh, mm. do-gooder? Exactly. We lent him quite a sum. It seems like he has little intention of repaying us. He was quite ridiculous when I went to see him. You, uh, you've not been to see him yet, I take it. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, it's just had a lot on. I'll go give him a gentle reminder. Not so gentle. I don't like his kind. Superior. As you wish. Yeah, sure thing, Strauss. Perfect timing. I mean, get a bombshell dropped on me, and then you want me to go collect more debts. Good to know, you greedy bastard. Son of a bitch. Alright, cool. No, we'll go take care of this right now, Strauss. No, that's fine. Alright, give me a second. I guess we're in this. Alright. So. Unbeknownst to me, after returning to camp and finding a letter from a, a long lost friend of Arthur's, uh, Strauss decided to give me a jab. And I, I didn't know until I realized there was something on my map that I needed to go to because I couldn't do anything else. So. I have to go do what that guy needs me to do so I can do other shit. Alright, 
So the ranch is just over yonder. Time to do a little bit of uh, money collecting on the behalf of Leopold Strauss. see in Arthur's mind though it's it's a million miles away after getting that letter who was she to him a story he doesn't want to share with me I mean he gets all grumpy and starts shooting at me it's not pleasant I don't appreciate it at all but at the end of the day we just drink our whiskey and be friends because that's what outlaws do Shut up and do that outlaw cowboy shit. Hello? Oh, there you are, mister. Mr. Thomas Downs? Yep, that's me. You owe me money. Uh, oh, no, no, I'm, I'm, I'm... Oh, are you planning to hit me with that? We ain't a charity, Mr. Downs. Oh, come here, you maggot. Please, sir. I'm, I'll... Really? Oh! Certainly, would you? Oh, please, I have a family, sir. Please. Uh huh. I don't care about your family. I'm working, <coughs> working as hard as I can. Why did it have to come to this, huh? Believe me, sir, I didn't want this either. I wouldn't pay it up and then a sack easier. <sighs> You borrowed money from my business partner, Herr Strauss. You owe him, you took the money. He wants it back, what's not to understand? <laughs> you... Where's uh, our uh, money? I don't have it. Sell your place. We already owe more than it's worth. <coughs> then sell your wife, or your family, or something. We ain't your idea of charity. Is that clear? <laughs> What are you looking at? Thomas! I said what you looking at, woman? My husband isn't well. If we could just have more... Like I said, we ain't nobody's idea of charity. Get us the money. This isn't the last time I see them. Didn't get the money, Strauss. Only got more angry. So thanks, you bastard. Somewhere for I might yell at Strauss. Ah, how did you get on? Not so good. He's almost dead. And they seem more or less destitute. You were a fool for lending them the money. Bad people who aren't desperate don't seem so interested in my propositions. Of course. You're a leech, aren't you, Mr. Strauss? Yeah, that's what you are. Well, job's done. Time to move on.
Well damn my fellow pixel heads, we want to say thank you once again for watching today. But we believe the shenanigans must come to an end. Oh man, that, that voice just takes over all of a sudden. You just, you just gotta roll with it. But yeah, Forever Echo and Arthur Morgan once again wants to say thank you for watching us here today. In the meantime, head over to the YouTube channel to watch all the other shenanigans that we've gotten ourselves into in this game. And maybe you'll find one of the other games that I've played. There's, there's a few. Old, old live streams. Live streams, yes. Because that's something I did back in the day. But today, we're creating these, these videos that I truly enjoy. And I hope you enjoy them too. So, head over to the channel. Subscribe. Hit those like buttons. Send me your comments and your feedback. To all current subscribers, thank you for all the support you are giving me. It, it's just it's just keeping me going and making me really put as much love into this as possible. So thank you, as always. Follow me on Facebook. Find me next Thursday for more Red Dead Redemption 2. And Forever Echo wants to remind all of you to be kind... Game on.